Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing a piece together video of all the different things that I'm doing to take care and clean my car and keep it organized because I realize after a child that things get really messy really quickly and also um, I wanted to have a type of organization for my car um, that I could use with multiple children so like whenever I have the next baby I can just order like a couple items to put all their stuff in and it'll be good to go so welcome to my car organization video I hope that this is insightful helpful um, and can help any mom out there um, so yeah let's do it I just moved here a couple weeks ago um, into our new space and basically I have not organized anything and now I'm getting back into the organization and I'm watching a ton of YouTube videos on how to um, organize your car, organize your house, organize your life um, and so a lot of that is going to be coming at you on how I'm doing it because all of these systems I have had in place for a while now um, and I can see myself being able to do this for a really long time meaning like I can do this with multiple children because we plan on having a larger family um, so whenever I'm doing all of my systems right now I'm actually planning on my son's right here um, I'm actually planning on doing this with every single child and maintaining that. So, without further ado, I'm going to show you my changing station. So this I got um, from Skip Hop, and I got it from my registry. I had it on there. Someone bought it for me, which is wonderful. I'm super grateful for that. And I didn't really know how I wanted to use it, so it's just been kind of a catch-all for everything. Um, but then I just decided that I wanted to use it as a diaper changing station. Can you see this? This is how come you'll see in the next clips, but they're all like literally just him trying to pull his camera away and me having to move every single angle in the world to be able to show you what I did. So, anyways, let's continue on. That's his toys. That's your toys. So this is what I did. Um, and so on the top, I've got like the diaper changing mat. Um, it's currently being washed, so I'm just keeping a blanket in here. But I'll use that as a mat too, so I'm not really that worried about it. I've got some extra washcloths for literally anything. Um, the wipes fit right in the middle. On this side, I've got some butt paste. I don't ever use this. I usually make my own. Um, but this has been since he's been born. They gave us this on our registry, and so I just have it in here. Because it's going to get hot and stuff like that. And this is this is fine to use for whenever we are on the go and we need something. So then I have the wipes. These are H-E-B brand. Um, I got these in a pinch and so now I'll use them for like on the go wipes basically. And then I have like a little band-aid little section where I've got like a little first aid kit. Um, and it's got just like little band-aids and just random things like that. Um, and then it has cotton balls and baby Q-tips. So in case you've never seen a baby Q-tip before because I didn't until I had my son, this is what they look like. Isn't that crazy? Um, and then some cotton balls because I would use that for whenever we go swimming. So down here, if I had multiple children, I would put them all vertical like this. And I would put like their name on there or like a color or something. So that way I knew um, which baby, like I could easily grab which size it is because they all look the same whenever they're vertical. Um, anyways, so I have his swim diapers because we like to go swimming. Um, and sometimes it's just impromptu, and so just to have some um, is really helpful um, for our swim lifestyle. Um, the other thing I have is just his regular diapers. He's in size 4 now, um, and so I have those in there. And then I just have a washcloth, I mean, sorry, burp cloth, um, and that's just as a placeholder in here so the diapers don't slide around. And just because, like, just to have. Um, I think it's important to have one for literally anything. It could be anything. And if we have an impromptu swim date, I want to be able to be properly, um, like, use that as a towel. Not like any of the people that we have won't have a towel, but just if in case it's like... Anyways, the point is, I like them. And this is the setup that we have. See, it's a skip hop. Anyways, 
Um, I find this super helpful. I think it's amazing. And this is the one that like straps onto your car. And I plan on actually using this forward facing, like to where it's, I'll show you whenever I do my reveal on my car. But this is one of the things that I wanted to set up in my car. And so I'm showing you now. All right, so I wanted to show you how I did this. So this is my before. This is the Skip Pop brand that I've shown you previously. Um, and that was all the stuff that was in it. And then I collected everything that I would want to have on hand in my car. And so that is all of the things I'm showing you now. Um, and it was just stuff that I collected around the house. So then I started to put all these items together um, and try to occupy myself at the same time. So you might see him trying to grab the camera and different things like that. Um, but it was super sweet. He was trying to help and was beautiful. Motherhood is one of the most beautiful things I've ever had um, done in my whole life. And there he is. Aww. Um, but I was just packing up all these things um, and trying to get them to fit properly in the bag. It's a lot of trial and error, um, to be honest with you, just kind of depending on how many kids you have um, and what you want to have on hand. So this is just my diaper caddy, so I never needed too much stuff. Um, but just enough to have and yeah so that's what I did and then this is how we set it up in the car front facing how I was explaining so I hope that was super helpful hello so I got two huge shipments in from Amazon that I'm going to show you because it actually pertains to my video okay because I ordered a lot of things from Amazon that are going to organize my car. And so I wanted to show you guys so then I could show you what you need to get if you want to do the exact same thing that I am doing. I'm going to go get them and I'm going to bring them in. Hi. Okay, so I'm going to show you the things that I purchased. You don't have to purchase these. These are just some ideas um, based off of what I came up with with how I wanted to organize my vehicle and my car take the good and leave what else you don't want um for you to come up with and your ideas so without further ado let's get started so first thing is this accordion organizer situation um you open it up and it becomes like this huge um storage like back um like in the trunk storage and then it also has um, a insulated portion, which I think is really helpful for if we want to go and bring some sparkling waters with us to a friend's house or um, whenever I'm getting groceries. So that's what this is. And it folds up really nicely and has these little straps. So that's the first thing. The next thing I got was this small wireless vacuum cleaner if you watch jordan page's youtube video she talked about how this was literally a must so i also got it because it's really nice and i know after we go on car rides or trips um or once a week i'm going to vacuum it out so there's that um this gotta open it This is the trash can that I picked out. And basically what you do is you put this strap um, inside the console and then close it and it stays open like this. So that's what this is. Um, and then the, this one's my favorite part so hopefully this works out how I want it to because I'm like really 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 excited about this <clears throat> um it is this organizer like this oh you gotta put it together one minute I 
Anyways, it's this organizer where you can put like different things. There's like a pocket in the front, and there's this huge giant space right there. There's pockets. Oh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Got like a little separator, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, there actually is two of them. I don't know if I'll we'll use both, but anyways, um, anyways, it's got like two like little spots right here. It's got a pocket in the front. It's got pockets on the sides, pocket on the back, and then this spot right here is where you will put your um, seatbelt. But I plan on doing one with the seatbelt in the front with me whenever I put my purse and everything else in here. And then another one where my son sits, um, and it will go, th this will go through the actual um, armrest. I'm thinking it'll fit through there. I'm hoping it does. Um, and that's where it's going to have all of his stuff. So, we'll see. I got two of those, and that's pretty much all I got from my car in total. And so, I'm just going to show you, like, what I do and where I put everything and how it all works. Because there's a lot of different parts. Oh, and then also, I'm going to put this box in here. So, when we use my car and my husband has to put something for his business... Because he works with cars and vehicles and diesel and it's always like gross and grimy, all of his stuff. He has to have a box to put all of his stuff in. So I'm going to use the box that all the stuff came in to give to him. Um, anyway, so I'm going to put this together and then um, I will see you outside in the car. Alright, so I wanted to give you a fair, like, before of everything and that's my bag that I showed you earlier um, and then this is my car it's literally a disaster and there was no organization I couldn't find anything so I am just showing you how literally crazy it is so I started and I took everything out of it so that's what I'm doing here is just taking it out starting fresh and really trying to get everything organized and put away um, and these Amazon like little signs that I had for the car. They were super easy to put together. They weren't anything complicated and I actually used this for my groceries. So I'll put all the cool things in that little um like uh, I guess cold portion of this container. Um and then the other two I put the dried goods and so it, it seriously is amazing and then I can take my groceries in all in one swing by holding on to both sides of those handles and just walking in the door and so it has made it super easy um, as far as that is gone and I truly appreciate it. And then that other red bag right there is my doula bag. Um, I keep it in my car just so that way um, in case of emergency and I need to go I have an extra clothes and all the little things that I would need to be a doula. And so um, I keep that in there. I have a little gray bag that I'm looking at or resting with is actually my son's bag in case he has an accident or something um, I can put it in there and so just keeping it clean that way um, and so that's kind of what I did here alright and then here I'm actually just putting everything back in where I think would fit um, and trying to get it a little bit more organized so that way I can have it all set up and I, this takes me a little bit trying to figure out like what would be best um, just because of the sizing and everything like that so I'm just playing around with it and seeing what's, what's easiest um, for me and what I like oh also just as an update that green and that green that um, gray bag that wet bag um i actually put that in my diaper caddy which you see here so i'm just getting all the rest of it set up and then i put like a little ball of cleaner in there 
just so I can wipe down any surfaces after a diaper change. Next, I'm setting up my trash can. This thing will save my life. I clean it every week, but whoever's in my car will just put all their trash in there. And it's like hooked up to the, um, I guess it's called console, and so that way it doesn't move and it doesn't fall and it doesn't flip. My last one would flip around and this one doesn't because it's actually linked and attached to something. So that's super nice. And then this is where I put my son's toys and his shoes and everything like that. Um, I actually end up now, I had it, you're going to see here, I actually put it on like the little handle um, of the seat. But it actually works out better for me to have it on the floorboard next to his car seat. So that way whenever I'm putting him in there, I can hand him a toy um, to where he'll be occupied and not screaming while I'm trying to put it in the car. Um, and then this also is really great for rotations, uh, toys in and out of the car. So I'll rotate his toys and I'll rotate the car toys. And so this is really helpful to bring in the house and bring back out. And so I'm just trying to get that all set up to where it makes sense and to where I like it. And then I put on this fan, um, cause in the winter it is, in the winter, the summer it's super hot. So fan is definitely a necessity. I'll show you today's sponsor. Today's sponsor, let me tell you is called pebble b and this is what the device looks like it is by far like the best thing ever so i lost my keys like four days ago i got this in a couple weeks ago um and i wanted to try it right away but then you had to but then i had to charge it which there's a charging port right there so I went ahead and charged it and then I've been meaning to put it on my keys for forever. Okay, so I lost my I lost my keys in my purse in my parents' house and I literally could find them nowhere. It took like six adults to finally find my keys. And so after that moment, I finally decided, you know what? I'm going to put this on my keychain and I'm I'm just going to do it. And so I did. <laughs> and it has been the biggest lifesaver because I don't know if you guys are like me, but I lose my keys and I lose my phone all the time. So I really honestly need something for my phone too, but that's what this is for and I can listen to it and it beeps and I can find my phone that way. But anyways, I have this one and it's like a phone that you, phone, a app that you download on your phone, um, which I'm gonna show you what it looks like. And it's this little B down here. Anyways, you download that app and you sync it to your device. You can put this literally on anything and it will it will find your device or your um, wallet, your keys, your... Um, some people even put this on their dog collar. I would not say that that's what Pebble Bee recommends, but <laughs> I have seen it. Um, but anyways, this is by far one of the best things ever. I'm going to leave their link down below. Um, and I wanted to say thank you so much for Pebble Bee for sponsoring. It is literally the easiest thing to set up as well. And it is combat compatible with the um, Apple tile. Like it, oh, what is it called? Apple, the Apple AirTag. It is compatible with that one. I don't know why I couldn't think of that. But it is compatible with that. And so if you want a either more inexpensive option with the best, like still the same quality or... Um, if you want, um, to just, if you have an Apple tag and then you want one of these cause you need another one, this is a really great option and it's really affordable and the Apple Air tag really isn't, but it does, it does and is compatible with something else, those. So if you have one of those, you can sync it up with the app and so you can find everything even though you still have one Pebble Bee and you have another Apple Air tag. So anywho wanted to share that this is like the last little bit it is by far one of the best things and while it's charging these things light up and so you can know that they're charging it's seriously the best and it matches the rest of my keys which i'll take
Alright, so now I'm just going to show you the rest of my car. Those egg cartons I actually get from a person who has chickens. So I give her cartons and then she fills them up and I give them back. So I just keep that in the car. Um, and then this is his toys and I keep his little shoes in there and everything like that. Again, this is nothing fancy. It just works for me. So if you are kind of struggling with how you want it to look, just remember that this is something that is helpful for you and really no one else. Like this is a system that you need. So anyways, I'm just kind of showing you again what everything looks like um, and where everything is in the car. And this has worked out really well. That um, black uh, bag that's in front of my diaper caddy, I actually ended up moving that in um, inside and using it for something different. So I that's just the only update. But everything else is staying the same. The fan we don't really use because now it's like winter time. Um, but during the summer, it was an amazing, amazing thing to have. Um, but that's it. Again, thank you so much for coming back to another video. You are always welcome here. And um, I will see you in my next one. Bye.